हे गाइस दिस इज कशिश पंचाले के द कोजी चेक एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय YouTube चैनल today's video i'm going to teach you how to make your own diy bald caps but let me tell you all beforehand that you need liquid latex in order to create your own latex bald caps and i have tried many different techniques over the years you know to get my own bald caps because honestly speaking bald caps to purchase is quite expensive and uh, i can't really and also you just can use it one time or two time the ball caps you can't really use it it's not reusable so every time i can't really buy a 700 rupees 800 rupees one ball cap so that's why i prefer making my own diy ball caps and it's very easy very very easy but you need to be careful also and yeah that's pretty much it but make sure before starting this video you do like comment and share this video if you are new over here then make sure you subscribe to my channel and don't forget to follow me on my instagram page the cozy chick and yeah that's pretty much it now without blabbering much let's just directly get into the video and it's going to be a voice over video let me tell you all this it's a voice over video and i have created the videos in time lapse so that it's it's a very slow process to maine isliye usko thoda fast kar diya hai so that's why but i'm going to explain you like everything in detail so don't worry about it and yeah without blabbering much let's just get into this video in order to achieve your personalized bald cap make sure you have these products so i have the pons powder few makeup sponges a uh, liquid latex from krylon and any regular powder brush will work before i start making my ball cap i always clean my table with a tissue paper you can basically make your ball cap on any table i this is a wooden table you can also create your ball caps on a glass table spread a very thin layer of liquid latex in a rectangular shape to avoid lumps and blend the edges really well you don't have to be quite precise in this you can just go with the flow let the first layer dry completely and then start applying the second layer remember to work in thin layers dip your fingers completely in latex before you apply it on table or else it will stick to each other and cause a mess I applied one more layer which I wasn't able to record due to technical issues but let all the layers dry completely and it should look transparent. Then use talc powder or flour and sprinkle it all over the transparent latex and spread it across the sheet with a powder brush. This step is mandatory and if you miss it you will face issues while removing your latex sheet because it will start sticking to each other and you don't really want to cause that kind of a mess. This is one of my favorite procedures. Peel the bald cap from the edges and apply powder or corn flour as you peel the entire sheet. Remember that applying powder and peeling the sheet both should be done simultaneously. If not your entire bald cap will stick to itself and it will be ruined completely. This step is very crucial so concentrate and take your time to peel the bald cap slowly. Your final bald cap should look something like this. The material looks semi-transparent and it is very thin because I only applied 3 layers of liquid latex. You can definitely add more layers of latex and make it opaque. In order to remove the powder, I wash my bald cap sheet in cold water. As you can see after washing the sheet looks completely transparent but don't worry because once it dries out the semi transparent effect will be back spread the sheet on table properly unfolding the edges and making them as flat as possible once you are done flattening the bald cap use a cotton towel and pat down on the sheet properly to remove any excess water Do the same procedure on both the sides of bald cap and then rub the cloth very gently in upward directions to get rid of bubbles from the sheet. Do the same procedure on the back side of the sheet. I personally like doing this step because I don't really like the excess powder sticking on my hair and that's why I always wash my bald caps with cold water. and then i usually pat them down with any cotton towel so 
so guys this is how the final bald cap looks like it's extremely lightweight because i have only used like three layers and ye bahut zyada lightweight hai stretchable bhi hai but don't stretch it stretch it a lot because ye fat bhi jayega and yeah this is how it looks and i i just directly apply it like this on my hair on my head and also maine ye video mein application nahi sikhaya because i'll be making a second video for this so that it will be easy for you to understand because this is going to take time isse apply karne mein thoda time jata and explanation bhi jayega so that's why i'm just going to make like a complete different video for the application of this bald cap and yeah that's pretty much it i hope you guys have learned something from this video if you are trying out this method then do let me know in the comment section below and yeah that's pretty much it i'll meet you in my next youtube video bye bye